Good morning, everyone. I am here today with the game Roll Camera, the uh, filmmaking board game. It is a cooperative or um, single-player game by Malachi Ray Rimpen and King Bean Studios. Malachi uh, created the game, but um, I was sent a review copy by um, Grand Gamers Guild, who helped publish it here in the U.S., and I, I've enjoyed the game, so that's why I wanted to show up on stream this morning. Um, wasn't obligated to do so, but I, I think it's a, a fun little game, and it's a it's a good kind of like um, game night game. So, um, and the the solo the solo mode's interesting enough. So, um, yeah, we'll, we'll get right into it and talk about it. So, the, uh, in the setup, let's. Here. In the setup, we have um, our scenes that are over here. You uh, shuffle those, and then you put one here and here, and then you get five uh, of the uh, bottom part of the script, five of the top part of the script. You shuffle those, put those out, and then we have our uh, set pieces for the layout in here that kind of makes a 3D puzzle. We have um, some problem cards, and we have also our um, ideas. Four, and I should have three of those actually in hand because um, we use those at production meetings. And then we have our dice, of course, and the dice we just roll. Uh, but first, the very first thing you do every turn is, oh, one more thing. You do have this handy dandy thing that reminds you of everything that you do on a turn and it has your budget and schedule on. So in a normal game for uh, one player, and I'll zoom in here so you can see this, but in a normal game for one player, you uh, set it here, one player, normal difficulty, and here for the budget. So you have 10 days and uh, $12 million, $12,000, I don't know, whatever you have here. And so that's there. Um, oh, and I'm, I'm also playing with the production companies. So this is probably going to be a mess. I'm probably going to be terrible because this one is... Uh, production company, whenever I take the production meeting action, play all idea cards face down in a pile, shuffle the pile, and choose one randomly to play, discard the rest, and the to-do list is not available. Okay, so that means <laughs> um, this will be interesting because the production uh, meeting definitely helps you get things done in the game. So we'll, we'll see how this goes. I, I'm not super confident about that, but... Uh, uh, that's what's gonna happen. Okay, so I just thought it would be fun to try one of, one of these. I, I tried one before and it was different. They're all different. Um, so that I just drew randomly this morning uh, for setup. Um, well, that, that's gonna that's gonna make the game interesting. All right, so that's already kind of a problem, like an additional ongoing problem. But our first problem this morning is the script fell into a paper shredder. At the end of each turn, shuffle both the top and bottom script decks to create a new randomized Okay, this is not going to go well because I like half of what you're planning for here is for this to be good. Because you either want your your um, your quality meter to go up here. Here, I'll, I'll scoot the board a little bit this way so we can see that a little better. But you either want your quality meter to go up uh, like this. So it gets to the top and it's a cinematic masterpiece, or you can have it be down here at the so bad it's good and win. Um, either way, uh, you can you can win, but you don't want to be in this section here. So I feel like between the randomness of this and the randomness, uh, well, I can deal with this problem right away, but the randomness of this is going to make it more difficult. So the very first thing you do is you draw that problem card and then you get to roll your problem uh your production dice. So we're gonna roll those, see what they are, and we'll start assigning those. And they do have different faces. Let's uh zoom in and see here what the faces are. So here we have uh the film crew, we have the lighting crew, uh, we have more lighting another lighting crew one. That one just hasn't Looks like the dot blood a little bit on that. This is special effects, which is wild. And then there's the art department. So we have all those to assign to different things. And uh, as we do that, oh yeah, 
And I, I also didn't talk about I am the director. I just decided to pick that one because uh, the director, uh, you can put here your film crew or your actors, and then you can switch out uh, $3 for two days or three quality for two days or so forth to three money, whatever. And then all of them have the same. You can reframe um, to put a uh, scene into the trash by spending two or you can put a single die here to get three new ideas. So that's probably never gonna be used in this single player game right now because of this production company. So, all right, all right, let's take a look at what we wanna do. Um, I don't know that I wanna resolve that problem right now um, because I don't love my um, my script right now. My script is bloody, bloody morons, which fine, whatever. But it is you have to have two uh, two angry faces and uh, for, to get two quality, and then three um, of the purples, which I think are uh, comedy. Um, so two angry faces and three comedy in order to get five quality at the end uh, going up. I'm almost thinking I might want to just go down on quality. So I guess I could ignore that and I could solve the problem and I could get more money and I don't know. Either way, I'm gonna have to shoot five scenes to finish this game up. So um, do I have dice that are relevant for scenes? This one is a film company and, oh, and I gotta make sure this is on the start. Uh, film, uh, filming crew, art, lighting, and actors. Actually, I could just get that one done right now. It would cost me four dollars, and I would get an extra day on my schedule. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna do that. Cause let's see here. That would be four dice, and then I can put the two here and get rid of this. So you know what? I am gonna do that. I'm gonna do that, and I'm gonna. Turn this this way uh, to show that it's resolved. Because every time you get five resolved, you get uh, $2 or a day on your schedule. So I'm gonna do that. I'm going to shoot this scene. Oh, I need, that's right, I have to build the set first. So I'm not gonna be able to do that. Oh, well, well I made a decision, so I, I, I'm putting those there. Um, I think we will well, let's see here. Um, I mean, I could have, I could have done this. So, so I'll just do that. That's resolved. I'm gonna put the two equal ones here to get out this stuff and start uh, working on this scene. I'm gonna put this one here, and then I'm gonna have to put. Like that one there, which is going to give me an additional problem, but that's okay uh, next time. Okay, so we'll start shooting this scene, and I'm going to put this here and this here. That gives me a quality, and I can't finish sh shooting this scene because I need another uh, set piece. I forgot that I didn't have any set pieces out yet, and I'm also out of dice. So, uh, okay, so I have to advance the schedule. I only have nine days left. Take these ones off. And then we get a new problem. Let's see what our new problem is. Our new problem is <clears throat> Deadly Wasp built a nest uh, in one of the editing rooms and put a block token on any empty editing room space. Scenes cannot be played there. We're going to have to find a way to clear that. Uh, so we just get rid of that when we need to. Okay. And we roll. And let's see here. We did get two equal ones there, but we also have those. You know, I'm going to, uh, I'm not going to worry about this problem yet. We can put that one off for now. And I'm going to put these two lighting here and get, let's see here. 
I know this would give me an additional problem, but I'm going to put it like this. And then we need uh, an actor. I need one more lighting right here, but that gives me a dollar right away. And then uh, I'm going to uh, let's go ahead and play a production meeting. Now, remember, because of uh, our, our production company, we have to uh, do it randomly. Uh, so I'm going to pick, and hopefully it's, I have a one out of three chance to, for it to get picked. Um, <clears throat> uh, let's see here. What do I want to pick? Discard a scene from the scenes, gain a money or a quality. Uh, this turn, all bonus spaces have two. I'm going to do this one, the one that gives me money or quality. I'm not even going to look at the two that I draw from the deck because it doesn't matter because of this production uh, company, the Blindfold Media. And then we're going to shuffle these, draw one, and play it. So we'll see how this goes. And here's what we have. We have, uh, oh, I got mine. Cool. So uh, all the rest will go in the trash. Let's see what they were. They were choose any uh, tile from the stacks and replace an unoccupied. That would have been nice. Ignore all problem effects this turn. Uh, uh, not, not a big deal. Okay, so I get to discard one scene. I'm going to discard this uh, green one, this drama one, and uh, put it on the bottom there. And then uh, these will go down. That makes this one cheaper. And another comedy. Okay, cool. That's up to now. I'll turn it in. Um, and then I get a dollar or a quality. I think I want to go with quality. Um, uh, so that's my second quality because I also got the bonus over here. And then I draw a new card. And that's the end of the day. I'm going to leave those three there and do that. This will um, move over. So now we draw a new one. Our new problem is I'm going to roll those. Our new problem is uh, the producer insists on giving the niece a role in the film. One additional actor required for every scene. That's annoying. It can be placed on an any available blue space on set one shooting. And I should have uh, also advanced my schedule, so I only have eight days left. Okay, so that's a problem. Additional actors. So I think I will resolve that because I didn't get the camera I needed up here anyway. If I got the camera, I do have an additional uh, actor, but um, I'm going to, you know what, no, I will, I will, I'll put that actor there, lock it in, and then I will resolve this one. That's what I will do. And with that, that's the end of that turn already. Um, so we're already down to seven production uh, days. In my experience, that's the biggest thing you're fighting against in this game is the production clock. Even more so than the budget. It's kind of easy to get money uh, sometimes, but not not necessarily to get more days. Okay, so let's roll again. Hopefully we get a while or a... Uh, uh, so, uh, let's see here. Because we started on normal, that was one, two, three, four, and I've done one, two, okay. So, yep, new problem. Okay, yep, we're on the correct space. Um, did I? I did get a wild, so that's good. So hopefully, I can use that to finish this scene off. Uh, assigning cameras to any action, including placing on set, now costs a dollar. Okay. Um, uh, fine. So, this scene is going to cost me four dollars. Plus, I have to draw another problem. But I'm going to shoot this scene. Because I need to get these scenes done. So, I'm going to do this one. And there's our first scene. And it, uh... It does have notes about how you would shoot this. That's low angle, 40 millimeter, has a prop. And then you flip it over to the color side, and it goes into your movie. Okay. That comes down here. I guess these are all upside down now. And then, let's see here. Okay, so we have to draw another 
problem because I placed it on the problem one here. And this one says the cinematographer insists on shooting on 120 millimeter film. Every scene now costs one more dollar to shoot. Um, so actually, I think uh, because I placed that here, that would have been true. So I'm down to eight dollars also. Okay, so we have problems. We have a full set of problems to deal with. Um, and the other thing that should have happened with this one is nothing. This one doesn't give me anything else. Okay, so nothing. And that's all done. We advance our days. We're down to six days left and eight dollars. And I don't know that we're doing so hot. Um, Oh, I did have one more thing. You know, let's have another production meeting before we go on. But I did already think that, so I don't want to pay any more money right now. I need, I need money. Um, I guess I'll put this one. And I don't like this idea. Hopefully, I don't draw that one. But it's all random now because of the production company. Um, okay, so let's see, shuffle and see what we get. This is just adding to the randomness. Uh, okay, so the one I got was gain $3 and draw another problem. I can't draw a problem, problem though because my problems are full, so that's good, but I do get the $3. That was, that was a good production meeting. Um, and I get all my dice back. We finish that scene. I don't need them on there anymore. I made a uh, whipped cream from from scratch with from heavy whipping cream yesterday. It is good. Okay, so let's see here. Um, so scenes are more expensive now. Also, assigning cameras will cost me, and I have a block scene currently. So I, I probably need to deal with some of that, but maybe I can. Get some other things set up first. Let's see. This one's gonna cost me two actors. And I can I can can I even do this yet? I can't even do this yet. So because I, I can turn it like this, like put it um so it has uh audio actors, actors, film, but I would still need one more blue here. Um yeah. But I don't have all that yet. So I guess first, so here's an audio and an actor. And I, I'll probably commit that. But I think what I will do first is I will... I'll start resolving some stuff. So let's, um, yeah, let's, let's just do that. Let's resolve both of these. And because that allows us uh, to have four, four done. Um, yeah, there's four, right? Not five, yep, four. And with that, um then I could assign this one uh audio here and the um you know if I did that differently I could turn that. Maybe that's what I want to do. Um yeah, let's see what the problem is. It's fine. I'm gonna put the actor there, get another problem. <clears throat> Uh, everything is going wrong at once. Whenever you resolve any other problem, immediately draw a new one. Okay. All right. So problems. Um, but I get these back. Uh, we spend another day. We're down to five days already. And so get our new problem and roll. So our new problem is the art team is now using gold leaf to paint everything 
sending art department to any action, including placing on set costs a dollar. Okay, well, that's good because we don't need the art department for this scene. Um, <clears throat> but we do have art department here, so I maybe I should just get rid of that first. I'm gonna get rid of that one first. That gives us, uh, I'm gonna get a day back, is what I'm gonna do because that's our fifth card, and we'll remove those out. Um, and then I will resolve. Uh, oh, shoot. I guess I should have done it in, in a different order. Um, so I should do this one first and then resolve that one so that that one doesn't cost me anything. And that would have meant, oh, can I even, okay, so can I even do that? That's the question because of the order this is in. Um, so I could have resolved this one. Yes, that's the order I want to resolve that. Okay, so I could have resolved this one. And then this one would have been resolved. And we're fine. Okay, all right. So all I did that day is resolve problems. And we're back to five days schedule. And we're going to get a new problem again. And the problem is the director wants to do over 100 takes of the shot. Each time you shoot a scene, lose one schedule. Okay, that's... Especially uh, problematic given that we are on a tight schedule on that one. Let's see, there we go. Okay. Oops, that was an actor. All right, so we need actor and film, which we have. Uh, but first, I need to get out another um, thing. So I'm going to do this one that gives me another dollar. And do I want to get rid of the one that cost me a day? Yes, but maybe I want to just go ahead and shoot this one. And then I get all my dice back. Yeah, okay, that's what I'm going to do. Okay, so this one I have to put my actor here and my film crew here. And that gives me a dollar. Uh, but it's going to cost me a day. And then it's going to cost me three more dollars um, because of where this is at. But then I get a quality. And there is my new scene. It's some people laughing at something uproariously. Okay. So that's that. And that's going to go there. And I get all of my dice back this time, which I think I need. We'll see. Oh, and this one, let's see, this one should go over here because I don't have five yet. That's my pile of five over there. Okay, so now my new problem as I go into day three, three days, of, I mean, my biggest problem really is uh, I need, I need some, um, I need some more days on the schedule. So I could go here, shoot that. But this problem is the editor is recutting the film as an experimental avant-garde art piece. Each time you shoot a scene, shuffle and randomly redistribute all scenes in the editing room. Uh, if there are less than two scenes, shuffle this problem back into the problem deck and draw a new one. Okay, that that doesn't matter. I don't care about that one right now. That's fine. Um, so let's roll some dice. And let's see here. Three film crews, actor, and two audio. I think I'm going to go ahead and use the two audio. Well, let's see. This gives me a day back, but it costs me four money. So maybe I should do that for now. Or what do I have for cards? I mean, I forgot to draw a new one. Um, flipping on these, that just gives me money. This gives me double Bonus list. if you have a shot of scene, this gives me money. Um, but again, I only have a one in three chance of getting the thing I need. So this one's going to be hard to shoot because, let's see here, it's going to be like two actors and then a sound would go here and then it would be actor, film, 
and I don't I don't even have this set up correctly for that. So um let's let's do some let, let's get rid of this this problem and let's get rid of another problem maybe because then maybe we can get some days back faster um you know what? you know what? we're gonna get rid of this problem just be done with it now and then we're gonna have a production meeting and i guess i'll put the one in that gives me money for not shooting a scene this turn and then we draw two and then we shuffle i think like usual my biggest problem right now is the scheduling and so we'll see what we get it is put shopping cart wheels on the sets move and rotate any number of scenes okay that might actually help for next time um because if we can shoot this one okay so how can we shoot that one that's that's the question so basically we need two across the top let's see um two across the top and then Two across the top, a microphone, and then two like this. So maybe it needs to be two across the top. Uh, two across the top like this, and then we can start the actor here, and then the film here, and put the microphone right here. I think, okay, and, and what I'm trying to set up, and I'll, I'll show you here, is the, uh, this card. So this card, I think, I think I have it set up where I could do it now. Actor, actor, microphone, uh, audio, actors, and film. Um, okay, I think, I think that'll be, I think that'll be good. Uh, but the big problem now is I only have two days left to get all this done. Um, and we're gonna get a new problem and roll. And that is, the visual effects team accidentally flooded the set with sulfuric acid. Oh, neat. Crew dice can now only be placed on non-blue spaces on set pieces. Existing dice may stay where they are. That's really annoying. So I'm gonna deal with that one. Um, especially after we went through all that setup. So I guess, what do we need? We don't need these two lighting things. So I'm going to use those two lighting to resolve that. And then, um, but I'm running out of days. Oh, I forgot to roll this production one too. Okay. Uh, actor. Okay. So I have four die. Um, uh, but this needs five. Let's see here. Let's put the film down here. Film group down here that gives us quality. And then a uh, dollar here. And I just remembered that I'm the director. So that's a good thing. Uh, I'm going to place this one here as uh, the, uh, the audio department. And then I'm gonna use my compromise as director, my special ability. Uh, my special ability lets me uh, trade in three money for $2. So I'm going to do that. Uh, three money for, for two days. So I'm back to four days. And that's why I picked the director because I knew I'd need that. And that's all my dice. Um, yeah. So I need to roll perfectly. I need um, two actors. Two actors is what I need. And let's see what our new problem is. Our new problem is the sound person needs complete silence so they can record 
room tone. Only the player whose turn it is may speak. Okay, that this is a two-player only one, so we're just going to get that one out of the game. This one is a money problem. The lead actor... Uh, oh, yeah, by the way, the, it does kind of give you a preview of, of what's going to come. It, like, this one has money on the back. Um, the lead actor rented themselves a private diamond-studded hot tub limousine, $1. At the end of each turn, lose a dollar. Okay, it's not great, but it's not the worst thing. Um, so... Let's roll, and, well, that stinks that we, there's our other actor. Um, I could try and do a production meeting. Or I could just resolve this problem. I think I'm just going to resolve this uh I could turn my movie into a really terrible movie and then, then uh, just try to get down here instead. And then um, if I do that, I can turn my quality that I have into, into days and time. So maybe that's what I start doing. Um, The biggest problem with that is like this one gives me more, but maybe I don't want stuff that gives me too much quality. So maybe I, I start balancing that up. Uh, you know what? I'm going to do that. I'm going to turn three quality, one, two, three, into two more days of time for me. And then um, I'm going to have a production meeting. And with that production meeting, I'm going to... Um, I guess I'll just try something crazy, because why not? And I don't even know that I get to play it, so we'll see what we play here because of my crazy production company. And... All right, let's see what we actually have to do. Look through the top 10 cards in the idea deck, or idea trash, choose one and immediately play it, okay. So I don't want to do that one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And okay, flip an unused card. I don't want to do that. Replace one half of the with another half. Um, then gain a dollar or a quality. I mean, that's interesting. If you haven't shot seen this turn, gain two dollars. Uh, that one wasn't bad. Gain three dollars and draw a problem. No, pay one and draw a problem to gain two days. Discard one scene from then gain one money or one cost. You know, I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna replace one half of the script, and then gain a money or a. Because um, I haven't seen a whole lot of ang of anger yet, so I'm gonna see if I, there's something that gives me. Ah. Here we go. This will help me do exactly what I wanted to do. Okay. Um, oh, but that's going to give me three of the... Oh. I guess... I guess... Let's see. One, two, three, four, five. You know what? We're going we're gonna to try to get a good quality film. I, I changed my mind. We're going to try to get a good quality film because we're back to six days and seven dollars. And then I'm going to get a quality. Um, so as the director, I changed my mind. Here's my new card. Oh, I wish I could actually like play my ideas. But right now, my production company has forced me into this silliness of being very random. Okay. Um, back down to five days. And we're going to... Flip a new problem. Oh, and I lose a dollar because I didn't deal with that. And this one is the lights are melting the set. We've got to shoot now before they're gone. If you do not shoot a scene, each turn discard one set piece of your choice per turn. Uh, clear crew dice that are locked in on that. Oh my gosh. Okay. So. The problems in this game have to be dealt with, generally. Um, 
Well, I think I'm going to be dealing with some problems, although I've got... So I think I'm just going to use these two to deal with this problem. And that gives me, I can take $2, because that's five. Um, yeah, that's five. So I will, I will take $2 this time, actually, because what I'm going to do next is I'm going to assign these and get a quality and a dollar and a dollar. Um, yeah, and so two more dollars and a quality. And now I just need, I, um, I need two actors next time. But the day is done, so now I have nine dollars, and we're back to four days. And I forgot to roll this one, so I will roll that one. Uh, that was art. I should have used that over there. Let's just say I remembered to roll that, put that there, and that goes there. So now all I need is one more actor to finish this scene over here. Okay, so that's that. And I already advanced that. Let's get a new problem. Our new problem is hundreds of extremely rare protected butterflies have taken out residence on our set. Moving and or rotating set pieces costs a dollar, even if forced to do so by another problem. Okay. All right, let's get our actor. Come on. Okay, there we go. Cool. There is our actor, which would give us another problem, but we're already full on problems, so no new problem comes out. Um... This, though, what about, I don't know what I want to do with this. So this, probably have a production meeting, but we're going to uh, spend $4 and get a day back. And we're going to put this scene over here to get two quality. And now this one, this problem actually matters because we have something besides purple. So we will rearrange these and go like that, that, and like that. I don't know that it's going to matter, but we had to do it because of this problem. Um, sometimes that would really matter right now. It's not affecting me a whole lot. <clears throat> I put my last one here to have a production meeting. So I'm going to Play this one, draw five scenes from the bottom of the scripts. Choose two and replace any two scenes on the scenes with them. Return the rest. Okay. And, and then we'll see what our random one is. I don't know if I'll get to play the one that I played or not. Well, we shall see. And let's see. Okay, so it is the one. I'm going to draw five from the bottom here. Um, can choose to replace two. So I'm going to replace one with this purple one. And none are angry, so um, we'll just do one that's easy then. Um, just in case, let's see. Just in case we have to do it just to get the game done. I guess we'll do this one. And put those away, and we're going to replace um, these two. So I'm going to place this one here and this one here. Because yeah, I think I want to do that, that purple one first, because that would give me three quality and get me up into the quality here that I need to not lose the game. Yeah, that wasn't bad. Uh, okay, so now we're back down to four days production. Uh, we lose a, a dollar at the end of the day because I still haven't dealt with that problem. We're probably going to have to deal with that soon. I don't have to draw a problem because I didn't do anything else. So let's see here. Um, I think first I want to get rid of that because that's just costing me money. Um, although I, when I do see that, I do get money so maybe that's not that big of a deal um 
but it looks like I'm gonna have to rearrange in order to to fulfill this one because it's uh, let me show you here it is uh, lighting actors filming actors and it's arranged like that and I just don't have that right now well maybe I wait I do I do I could go right here here but that won't give me money so I think what I will do is I'm going to uh, I'm going to deal with this problem let's see what I need here I need lighting I need uh, actors and film I got three uh, art department so I'm going to get rid of this problem resolve that problem and then um, I guess I'll just put the lighting here which gives me another problem uh, you wanted to fix in post but turns out that's very expensive from now on lose one dollar for each visual effects you use when shooting a scene I guess I will use that to resolve that problem so that's all I can do um, so we're down back down to three days so three days is done and have four dollars okay that's everything up there so let's uh, let's roll, get a new problem and roll some dice oh I did have this one before we do that uh, but I did already say it. so let's play a production meeting real quick um, I need to draw one more card from me oh that's two plus only, so I can't do it. I wish I could have done it. Can't do it. Resolve any problem and do not draw a problem. In this. Oh, I'm putting that in there, but I only have a third of a chance to get it. Hopefully that's when I get it. And then this one, give everyone unpaid day off, lose money, gain $3. I don't want that one to show up. Pay $4 and lose. I would lose the game if I do that. And lose three quality and immediately transfer one scene. Well, this is going to be an interesting time. My company might just go bankrupt right here. Um, and if so, I, I lose the game and I have this weird little movie that uh, didn't quite do what I wanted it to do. I guess that happens in real life too, doesn't it? Let's see if I... Okay, so lose a day, gain $3. That's not the worst thing. It's not great, but it's not the worst thing. Um... Because I didn't, I didn't have to shut down production right away. So that happened. <clears throat> um, let's go ahead and oh, start the next day though. Um, it our problem is your studio the space was double booked and you have to share it with a kids karate tournament. At the end of each turn, move one set piece to a far corner in the set area. That's dumb. Not helpful. Uh, although we could do this one in the order of that SSO. Um, so we will roll. And, okay. Film. And. Oh, I thought I, I did. I took it off. I don't remember what I had there. Oh, well. Uh, film. I need actors. I need. I got none of that. This is. This is silliness. I got I got three art department and two audio department people to show up. So that's just silly, not helpful. Uh not not helpful, not helpful at all. Um Well that that's unfortunate. That might that might be the game right there. So we're just gonna resolve some stuff. Um resolve both of these and that's four. I need one more to add anything worthwhile. Um, let's have a production meeting, I guess. And this turn seems this turn uh, actors are wild. Um, none of that is helpful. So bonus spaces have two times their. Uh, none of these are helpful. So I'm just gonna throw this one out there. Hopefully I don't get that one because it's useless. But. Um, Again, I have to do random because of my random production company here. So, makes it interesting, but I don't know that I like it because it, it makes it way harder to get anything done. Move and or rotate anyone. 
set piece and then gain equality. Okay, that's cool. I, I will do that. Um, I will gain my quality. So I'm going to, let's see here. Is there a way I can get this one done easier? I could do this like this, one, two, three, and then make the, so yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll do that like that. Okay. That's into my turn. We are down to one day. So, uh, maybe I should just try to shoot this one because that will give me a day back. Although I will get a day if I resolve another problem. So that's probably what I want to do. And then I can spend some money to get two more days. So that's probably what I'm going to have to do. Okay. So, oh, all right. You can no longer assign actors to any action, including placing on set. Okay, that's my problem. So I have to deal with that first. Let's go ahead and get a day. Um, yeah, yeah, I'm going to get a day. And um, then I'm going to use one thing that I don't need. So, um, so I need film, actors, lighting, and actors. So I don't need this one. I'm going to assign that over to my compromise on my personal board as director and get um, I'm going to trade in $3.00 for two more days of shooting and that gives me a little bit of, of leeway here okay but then I'm going to be back down to three days of shooting and I have to resolve a new one this is going to hurt my dice somehow uh, here's the visual effects team has left us to make government propaganda videos the visual effects signed from now on are not wild. Okay. Well, if I deal with that, then I can just shoot my scene. So I will deal with that. I don't like that anyway. Oh, and I'm supposed to be doing this. Not that it matters a whole lot. Should have been done at the end of last turn. But. Okay. Um. So I finished this scene, it will cost me $3, which leaves me $1, but it gives me the quality to go up there, and I only have one scene left to do. If I can get this red scene done, then I can finish the game. So now I have to shuffle these again. Uh, I have three days left to shoot one scene. I might, I might be able to pull this off. I'm actually in the not bad area over here on quality. Um, all right. And so that I could put things here and here. I can put, uh, yeah, because I can, I can twist this all around and here I'll show you what this one is. It is, um, this angry scene. Uh, so I can twist it around like that. I could, so I can put my audio here, my film visual effects, and then actors here like that is what I could do. So we'll see. Um, we'll see. Uh, okay. What, what is our problem though? That's, I think our problem in our money is, is uh, what additional sound required for every scene? I need, I do need sound in this one. So, um, I think the very first thing I'm going to do though, is I don't want this to be rearranged because I want the, the three quality at the end, I think. So I'm going to, let's see, I need actors. I need, I need film and actors. I'm going to use these three to get rid of this. Resolve that, and then 
Okay, so I'm going to assign this one here. And I'm going to assign this one here. And this one, um, oh, my, um, I think what I'm gonna, uh, I don't know what I want to do, um, I think I'm going to assign this to a uh, production meeting and just um, I'm not going to assign that one yet because I'm going to assign this here and I'm going to play this card that lets me uh, place uh, an actor as if it's wild. So I will do that one and see what if I get the one I need. I mean if I get money that'd be great too. So we'll we'll see what happens. I I need money. I, I really need money. I have one money left so all right and then uh this turn actors are wild okay so I can place this here if I do that I get another problem though Oh, because of the way I, I've done this. So, I could have put this here. Uh, okay, let's say I did that, because that makes more sense. That gives me one more money back. And then I can place this here. And then I, I, I'll i be able to get a money. And uh, if I put my actor there, I can do that. And then, that, okay, that makes the most sense. All right. Okay, that's done. That's done. So basically, I'm, I'm turning this like this instead of upside down. I'm turning this like this. That, that's what I decided to do. Okay, so that's that. New problem. Sorry, I'm dropping things. Um, new problem comes out. The wind machine has gone haywire and blows everything around. At the end of each turn, rotate all set pieces 90 degrees counterclockwise, even if they have dice on them. That's terrible for what we need right now. Also, we only have two days left. Uh, okay, so let's deal with some things first. Let's... Um, let's deal with this sound issue, because I didn't get the sound anyway. And then let's deal with that uh, that problem too. Is that five? I think that's only four. Yeah, that's only four. So we, um, we resolved all that. I mean, would that would that be the worst thing in the world to to turn pieces counterclockwise? Probably um, ninety degrees. That would go like that. That would go like that. That would, yeah, no, we're not doing that. That would totally mess me up. Okay, I just need to finish this last scene. All right, so that puts us down to one day left on the thing. <clears throat> it's going to be close. Let's see what our last problem is. Turns out the visual effects team was actually just smoke and mirrors. You cannot assign visual effects to any action, including placing on set. So that is literally the worst. Um, because I need uh, I need be able to do oh goodness what do I do um oh this is what I do I just resolve that that gives me a dollar takes me up to three then I place one here gives me one more dollar and then I place the last one there to do this one which will cost me three dollars 
puts me down to one dollar. And oh, this is gone because we, we didn't resolve this. Good, good, good. It cost me one dollar to shoot my last scene. Uh, I mean, leaves me with one dollar to shoot me shoot my last scene, which is this one, the angry guy jumping through a window, and I place it down here. And that is the end of my movie. Uh, it does raise my quality up one more. And then I look at the end of my movie, which is uh, I do have a, a uh, let me make sure I, I score that one right. Because that one, is, it says each angry and purple. Let me, I, did it have to be in the exact orientation it shows? For each of this color and that color, Scenes in the editor. Okay, so uh, that's two quality. One, two, and then I get. I have my three purple. I I made a cinematic masterpiece. I was able to make a cinematic masterpiece with. Once upon a time, there were some people kissing, and somebody saw it, and then there was a stinky guy in a towel or something. I don't know what what's going on there. Uh, stinky guy. Something weird is going on there. He's dripping himself. And then they were laughing at it. And they found out that it came from the toilet. And so a guy ran through the window and angrily to solve it, finally. So that's my cinematic masterpiece. I'm going to call it the Toilet Escapades. I was able to win. I don't think I forgot any rules. Um, I mean, I, I did have to... Remember, I uh, tweak some things, but that, that's the game. That's uh, That was on normal mode, um, and it was still fairly difficult, mainly because of my stupid production company that really gets in the way of when you can play these uh, uh, production meeting ideas without having to uh, throw them all away, and you can choose the exact one you want, and you can save them on your to-do list. Uh, being able to play these at the right time to get the right amount of money is really nice. So that all... Uh, we shut down production with $1 left with our movie finished, and it was a cinematic masterpiece. So I'm really happy with how that uh, that one turned out. That was a fun one. Um, I've had fun with this game every time I've played it. it it's, just, it's just fun to think about how the problems would be working out in a real movie, and I, I think that this is just a nice game to play. And even as a, a solo puzzle, it's, it's a nice game to play. So thanks, uh, Malachi. Thanks, Grand Gamers Guild. Hope you're having a good weekend. I will catch you later.